da 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 bam 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 it's the fire time okay we have flying lethality silent with draft which is almost a sealed deck okay so this is what we're doing p jam Again, a, 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 what? one of the genuine real people who does well in these runs, and I've got to try and beat them. Try and beat everyone, really. Uh, that's my thing. That's my jam. I want to be the best. I want to be the very best, like no one ever was. To slay the spire is my real test. To kill them is my cause. Uh, so who's at the top? And is it Hex? Oh, God. Right. So do I take Blur? It's the real question. Yeah, it's probably the only way to defend against some of these nonsense creatures. I'm going to take... Ooh, okay. Acrobatics is really nice. I'm going to take that. It's, again, things that defend me sounds go sound good. Skewer sounds really good. Blade Dance does a lot of damage. And another Acrobatics. A, pr a Dagger Spray, because that does a lot. And another Cloak and Dagger. Dagger Throw. Wait, Sucker Punch and Dagger Throw both do multiple things. Dagger Throw is pretty good. Take Deflect, because it's more defense. Ooh, another Dagger Spray? No, Calculated Gamble so I can draw my original Dagger Spray. Sneaky Strike for Synergy. Uh, another Deflect. A Backflip. And I will take a Sucker Punch. It's a, a collection. A collection of different options that I have available to me. Gotta make sure it still it keeps working. Blade dance, very good, very helpful. Riddle with holes is interesting, but it costs too much to make actual actual use of it. Gold is wonderful. The pillow is interesting. That shop is actually quite a reasonable one to go for. Because there are no other shops in this chapter. That shop is more than just reasonable to go for, it's Ah, uh, it's necessary. Okay, so there's some interesting options for relics. Piercing Whale is great. Ah, uh, quick slash escape plan. Yeah, more card draw sounds sounds pretty useful to me. I want the orange pellets. Do I want a poison stab? Let's have an escape plan because it's more card draw. It's gonna make my deck more smooth. I don't think I can do anything to Lagavulin. I don't think I can. I could be wrong. I'm hap I'm I'm quite prepared to be wrong. Uh All of my defense cards were in my hand is the problem. I think I can do it if I get lucky enough. Okay, so I can survive a single turn of Lagavulin. No more, no less. If I can survive another one, that would be pretty nice. Oh, it's close. I wish it was closer, though.
Can I draw something that will defend me, please? Um... The answer is not yes. I can I can shenanigans my way through with this, but I don't know how, or where, or when, or whence, or any of the the any of the information that I need. There is it does not exist the information that I need. Blade Dance into Calculated Gamble to draw some fun cards. Sneaky Strike, two Deflects. Dagger Spray, Quick Slash. Oh, that'll do it. Will it do it? It will not. It, it's, it's, it's so close. <laughs> Uh, Circle Punch takes it down to 15, but I need to play more cards to make that happen. Okay, that's enough that I didn't even need to play Sucker Punch. And that's not enough. I can do it, but I have to get lucky. And I'm going to reset until I get lucky because I want to see how big my score can get. <sighs> it's not really luck, it's just being... Being thoughtful, having a thought in one in one's head, going throughout the day, not being completely empty-headed. not big, head head small, head not full of smart, head full of stupid. wasn't very useful. It just does too much damage. It's possible. Bound to be. I deduced this from my deductions. Okay, so there's gonna be something to do, something I can do about this. I, I do want to offload a bunch of damage right on the first turn, because that's when I've got the most things in my hand. Oops, 
that's not quite what I had in mind. Still, it, it offers me a slightly different route, and I get the doubt back, wonderful. I realize that the only way I can actually get enough defense is through weakening him more or getting blur. And that is kind of lame. That is... That is not the victory I seek. Twenty-one. Not doable. In order to do it, I'd have to draw all my deflects and all of my uh, good defense cards as well. Opening this one by playing Blur does seem sensible. I can get to 11. Okay, hold on. So think, let's think sensibly. Think in, in big brain moves. Try and try and use the big brain. I don't want to spend all day on this black and villain fight, do I? That's not what I want. Okay. So I want to draw the deflects. I think I go for dagger throw into backflip. Oh, and then I have to play Blur, okay. I don't need to play Escape Plan, though. These are not the droids I'm looking for. Oh yeah, I needed those for next turn, not this turn. I've got 11. I mean, I've won one short. How do I get the other one? I think I'm almost there, actually. That's the thing. It's the, it's, it, it, the thing will change depending on what, how many cards are in my discard pile when... I go for some more. So dagger throw... Into backflip, into blur, escape plan draws me another acrobatics, that's fine. It takes me up to 13. Don't really need to do anything there, but this draws me a backflip. It's the two cloaks and daggers, and I've got my two flats. Okay, is that all that I needed to do to begin with? Except for the fact that uh, I obviously am going to be weakened now. Now I have to find the damage, and I'm pretty sure it doesn't exist. Can I get my deflect? No, I cannot. 
could have used that next turn. Seven. <laughs> Seven away. I think it. I think it's close to being doable. I just need to think, fig, figure out how how to actually do it. Sounds actually cut off. That doesn't happen very often with elite fights. Okay, got to maximize my output, which means not playing Blur. I just don't. I just don't play Blur, and that and that will kill you. Shiv, shiv, dagger spray. Okay. Oh my god, Paper Crane, are you serious? Dodge and roll. Finisher is pretty pretty useful. Finisher does a lot in this deck, full of shifts. Let's turn the sound back on, please. Fruit juice is interesting as well. Uh, obviously, I'm going for question rooms. Because that's how you get money. Hello, Gremlin Knob. You're much easier to kill than the last idiot. Significantly simpler to put an end to. Oh, I should have played Blur there. Oh, that was annoying. I had the perfect hand for defending against you on this turn. Uh. would have been very, very easy. Blur, deflect, deflect. Dagger throw. Cloak and dagger, shiv. Just, and then just attack. I just need to kill you. It's as simple as that. Shiv, 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 shiv. Dagger spray sucker punch. Easy. Full uh, oh, pissing whale, pissing whale against Hexaghost, maybe. Sounds good. Letter opener sounds pretty interesting. Letter opener sounds at least adequate. I do want to lose more health before I get to Hexaghost. Lagavulin again. I don't see it. I'm gonna have to do. <laughs> I know Lagavulin is possible. I've got I've got plenty of defense cards that can make Lagavulin possible. I just need to draw all of them. Oh hey ho oh, hey ho oh, hey! Like that's gonna be simple. Are you ready, kids? Ooh, well. There I might have flecked, like, not when I want to draw them. So I blur, I cloak and dagger. Acrobatics, nothing of consequence. And then I shiv, because I want to keep this defense for next turn.
blur into calculated gamble, which draws me a doubt. Still, I can get two blurs in a row, and that sounds pretty handy. That's not very handy though. That does not do what I need it to. No, I need to skip over the first couple of turns. I need to get that blur played. I need it to come out with something good and I need to draw plenty of cards as well. I need to do a lot of things that my deck just can't do, basically is what I'm saying. I would have had the acrobatics blur, yeah, that would have been really good with the deflects. It's a shame I was too dumb to actually do anything about that. Got one point of defense for next turn. Good job. Of course, now I still have to do more. It's not enough. There needs to be more stabbing. Oh! Oh! I forgot Incense Burner! I picked it up without even thinking about it. Well, that makes this a lot more straightforward. Ghost in a jar, that makes things a lot more straightforward. Deflect makes things a little more straightforward. Knob makes things a lot more straightforward. Okay. So it's not as if the situation is that bad. I wish I had blur. I wish I had more blurs. Right, I need to do something very, very violent to this snob to make him die. Or I just need to drink Ghost in a Jar. So I hit with a Sneaky Strike. Hit with a Blade Dance. And I hit with a Dagger Spray. That's a level of violence that I think is acceptable. Would you know it, another Blade Dance. It's actually really easy to kill things when you're very strong. Who would have thunk it? Who would have thunk it? Can I, uh... If I take too much damage, this elite might kill me. But if I take no damage, Hexaghost will kill me. Wait, I've got a ghost in a jar for Hexaghost. I might be okay. Or I might waste it on the elite. Even if I have got a Ghost in a Jar, I still want low health. Let's have another Piercing Whale. Maximize my Hexagos chances by maximizing the amount of screams available to me. Okay, what's a really good card to upgrade in this deck? Oh, I know. Calculated Gamble. The best card to, be, to upgrade in the, in the whole Silence Arsenal. You want to play it a lot of times. I've... Got to fight another Lagavulin! <laughs> Joy! Oh, wait, hang on. It might, in fact, be Joy. One, two, three. Four, five. And that. Uh, well, I mean, it was pretty close, but I couldn't manage it in the end. Maybe I do just drink the Ghost in a Jar here and pray for Piercing Whale against Hex Ghost. 
Would I regret it? I've perfected all the elites so far. I've... I, I, I remember now. I actually... <laughs> went all in. Until I could perfect that particular... Lagavulin. Let's go. Let's go for it. Let's go all in. I'm going to draw one of my many piercing whales against Hexaghost. No problem. Why wouldn't that happen? Do I want to choke? Okay, I've got a lot of shivs, and that's, that is what choke works with, but no. Now I want to... Oh, well, I'm going to take so much damage from Hexaghost if I'm not careful. Do I upgrade it to deflect? Ooh, 4 to 7 isn't bad. 4 to 7 is actually really quite potent. Okay, can I get my... Blur, thank you. Whoops, I should have played Sneaky Strike. That will do it. Blur is the key. 8 times 6, but never mind. That's all I needed to happen. Just a, a well-placed piercing whale and all is well. Save my other piercing whales, I think, because if I don't need to play it, I shall simply not play it. And Hexaghost doesn't have a lot of health, so it's just going to go down. And I don't even need to defend on this turn. And Deflect is MVP today. Can I draw... Anything defensive, thank you. Uh, yes, of course I can. That's what the deck is for, just drawing stuff until the right card comes along. And let her open up for a little extra damage. Marvellous. Shave, 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 deflect. Quick slash. Acrobatics. Deflect. I don't need to play it, but it's just fun to play more cards and make more things happen to Hexaghost, who quite clearly does not wish for things to happen to it. Yep, unfortunately things will happen to you, regardless of whether you want them to. I have had an idea about Sneko Eye, and I feel, oh no, no, because I, I've got orange pellets to make it not to make it only be card draw which is strong but it might also but I don't have any powers in my deck so I think hovering kite is actually the the correct choice collector at the top I don't actually need to look because remember I've uh, got plenty of options I can fly after all I can fly if I wanted to like a bird in the sky, I believe I can fly. Is that just Toy Story? I feel like Toy Story made a lot of references. Slice, dodge and roll, and terror. I like all of these, honestly. Let's take... Ooh, against... Against Collector. I, oh, let's go take the terror. If, if they're dead, they can't hurt me. That's what I've got to go with. Remove a card from your deck. No, I, I'm keeping all of them. You are going to be uh, killed quite horribly. If I'm honest, which I am. Stab, stab, stab. Stab. Stabity stab. Back flip. Shopman, you have arrived in an interesting place. Um, that would only affect Skewer.
but you know what, I'll take it anyway. Oh, and there's my power. I mean, lethality is turning lethal. Deadly poison, acrobatics, poison stab. Uh, oh, 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 incense burner has showed up at just the right time. All planned. Now die. All planned. Uh, still all planned. Still all planned. Ha! All planned! Baker, not bad. Quick slash, upgraded. Okay, let's take the upgraded one. I'm going to collect cards. That's just something that happens. Book of Stabbing can be screamed at. Assuming I draw the scream. Book of Stabbing isn't that terrifying an opponent. There we are. And of course, discarding cards gives me more energy, which is lovely. Stabity, stabity, stab. Let me teach you how to stab. Twenty four incoming, that's too much. Deal seven damage a few times. Not quite. Uh, not quite. <laughs> that was wonderful, wonderful use of the, of the skewer, though. Uh, that just, just I need more skewers, but it's pretty funny. Okay, let's go with the quick slash. A big, a big quick slash. Checklist to gamble into a big eviscerate and another blade dance. And if I do that, maybe skill will work. 10 damage. No, that's only 50. Which is enough. Another terror. Or a leg sweep. Ooh, upgraded terror is nice though. But leg sweep is weak. Weak is good. Flechettes is also good. There was all there were there were only good choices there. How annoying. Hello friends. We meet again. 
These are my knives. That just about did it. Oh, that's actually really good. At least in this fight. Outmaneuver, yeah, I'm sure. How about I take your money? Oh dear, that's it. That's what this deck is supposed to do. Uh, oh, another leg sweep or an upgraded blade dance. Take the upgraded card generally, usually quite good. Elites are fun. And I don't even have a preserved insert or anything. I'm just having fun with killing elites. At least now I am. Scream at you. Play blur, play outmaneuver. Now I've got energy and I can spend it all on a huge skewer, right? No. Wrong. That is not what happens. Can I have something good? Ah, thank you. This is why I can have nice things. I can have nice things because I'm just great. Oh, and of course I have this, too. Upgraded Destruction. It can be, it can be really good. After all, letter opener. That's two. That's two. That's two procs of letter opener in one card. I think that's particularly useful. Oh, I can give them the blood vial and get bites. That is a collector bonus. That is a collector bonus. But does it help me with my deck? Would it drown out the cards that are good? I think it would. And I think I'd have I'd find it harder to perfect things if I had a bunch of bites that I was drawing instead of my useful synergistic cards. Jack's test subject. Oh yeah, mutagens. That'll do it. I don't really plan on fights taking more than a turn. Ah, uh, oh, they're all they're all interesting choices. Let's do the blur. Okay. 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 Uh, that was a lot of damage for turn one. I would rather attack the back one. Oh, I've got bronze scales. That's useful too. Oh, you're not even doing anything this turn. 
Boring. Time to die. Like I said before, boring. Time to die. That's my line. Oh! <laughs> the thing has activated. The thing of doom. Not that it mattered. Boring, time to die. That that sounds about right. That sound, that's the name of this run. <laughs> ah! Finally! I was... I mean, one of those days you, you'd, get, you'd get a sacred bark after a fruit juice and actually be able to use it. Good old potion belt. What what a good little combination we have there. Huh. Right at the top we have the awakened one. I really need a lot of potions. At least hovering kite is worth a little energy, but I need more card discard as well, in that case. To make that one work. Oh, um, in reality, there's not a lot that I do need. I do not require things to win. Uh, yeah, fine, take it. So where are the good shops? There's a really good shop there, but I'll have plenty of time between. Oh, yes. Come to Papa. Come to Mama, even. Because Silent is clearly a mummy and not daddy. Ooh. I could bottle the terror or the blur. That is not what I want with Blue Candle. There are many options. I think the funniest option is Calculated Gamble. Oh, and I do want your potions as well. I want that, 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 and that, and that. And I'm going to move on because Swift Strike is not worth the gold. I can get curses. I just need to get lucky. Or I just need to not get unlucky because it's more likely that I will than I won't get curses. Centennial Puzzle would be great too. Right now. Uh, do I Calculated Gamble first? You know what I do? I think I just Blade Dance into sta stabbing you a bunch. Now I finish her. Now I calculate a gamble. Now I well laid plans. Now I quick slash. The rest should be pretty straightforward. So I can get rid of normality right there. I kind of need my piercing whale, if you please. That would be nice. Uh... That's no good. Right, I'm gonna need to use a potion, but that's fine. That's what I bought them for. Oh, I know what I can do. I can make this whole thing very straightforward. Double finisher. Triple finisher. Ooh, I got a nice new power potion out of it as well. Silent powers are okay. 
Nothing awful to say about them. Don't need you. Almost dead. Not quite. It really is remarkably easy to make things dead in this run. So do I take another cloak and dagger or another quick slash? Or another dagger throw even. Uh, let's go with dagger throw because it's upgraded and I'll probably find other cards later. Well, hopefully I will. I might have neglected it, neglected cards in that one, in that situation. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Let's just stab things. That's useful. Well, that's 51. <laughs> Not quite enough yet. That will do it. Fantasmal killer on next turn, and I'm not weak, and he's vulnerable. If ever I was going to get overkill, that is the situation in which it would happen. Except for the fact that I don't have cards. Seventy-two. Not enough. Um, okay, let's think about this. What if I played a bunch of cards that weren't cards, so my Akabeko stayed charged up? If I did that, I would be hit by the idiot and would have to deal with that. I don't want to do that. I am, I am still going to keep my Akabeko, I'm just going to do it a little smarter. Fifty-seven, that's what I thought. Oh yes! I can negate that as well. If I do it right, I need to attack for that to happen. Okay, I still have Akabeko this time. Just need to be really intelligent with my choices. 76. <laughs> Is it intelligent? To just play a bunch of powers and hope for the best. Oh, accuracy. <laughs> I didn't even need to play the other one. <laughs> yes, accuracy will solve the problem. Not that there ever was a problem. Ew. That's not very useful. Okay, I need to redo that anyway. So I'll just redo it and be smarter.
I'm in a different place with different cards. And of course, I do actually need to. Oh. Not enough. Accuracy would have solved the problem, but I didn't get it. Oh, alas. What I need to do is just attack then. This isn't right at all. I haven't even played Terror on him. What am I doing? This is nonsense. This is this is completely unacceptable. How how unacceptable? We hit him with terror. Play out maneuver. We play deflect. We play calculated gamble. I guess I'll play acrobatics. Because playing anything else doesn't make sense. Play Phantasmal Killer, because playing anything else really does not make... Oh, hang on. Damage. <laughs> playing a defense card made sense there. Nearly, nearly, nearly. Distraction into Phantasmal Killer. Preparation into Blur. Where did that energy come from? The Malty into Deflect, into Escape Plan, into hopefully the right powers. Accuracy, okay. Hundred and forty four damage with a massive shift. And now I can just uh Ooh. So yeah, that's the problem here. I've done a lot, but I I can't finish it off. Hmm. That's inconvenient. I know what I can do. I don't know what I can do. Uh, whatever I thought I knew that I could do, I did not do, and therefore could not do. Oh, right, this is different. I'm on a different world line now. Not really the ideal place to be.
think I have a solution. It's not even a particularly complicated solution. That's 48, but that's not enough, but that doesn't matter because what will happen now will be enough. Drink that. Let's take footwork instead of a thousand cuts. That gets me accuracy. Play that, play the accuracies, accuracy, footwork, footwork, escape plan, backflip, deflect, deflect, and a the mother of all ships. And even then, I'm not going to be able to defend, because I'm not going to draw anything like the right cards, so I play these. Hang on, they're doing 16. That's only doing 15. It doesn't matter, really. Play Doubt first. Shiv, shiv, shiv. Oh, uh, so yeah, the, the cultist potion was what I needed to do. Of course, now I get shuriken. And yes, let's complete the cloak and dagger set. Upgraded finisher is nice, but I've got plenty of them. Oh my god. Really? You're giving me extra money just in time for this shop over here? How fun. Hi, Reptomancer. You haven't got much health. Time to die. Let's see if I can get anything entertaining. Oh, that was entertaining. Shame I didn't play it. Doesn't actually matter. Really doesn't matter in the least whether I play cards. <laughs> I just have to kill things. Dodge and roll. Backflip. Um, upgraded dodge and roll. Uh, I mean, it's not that much better than backflip. In fact, it only, it's only six and six, and I don't really care about the numbers. I only care about some defense existing. Let's take the backflip because I want to go collectors on them. Okay, the question room for a nice rare relic. Ooh, ra rare relic friend. Let's go. You do not need to exist. It was not part of the contract that you have to live. Stone calendar, that was... that's actually pathetic. Why would I want a stone calendar? Fights aren't going to last that long. What can you sell me? Oh, of course. Preserved insect in the last shop. Ornamental fan sounds lovely. Crippling cloud honestly sounds useful. Reflex, likewise. And then because... why not? I guess I'll do... I guess I'll take those. Ooh, and that. And that. Six six cards. That's a lot of that's a lot of devastation that I'm capable of. So um how do I kill you? It's far from impossible. Oh, and there's Incense Burner. When do I want to be intangible? Turn one against the Awakened one? Do I get it to five? Is that what I do? 
Honestly, being intangible now sounds quite useful. I feel like I'm in an amount of danger. I know that I'm in an, in an amount of danger. Goodness. Uh, I guess I just killed them on turn one with the fire potion because I've got a fire potion. Me no dumb. Me know what me do. Me kill. Me stab. Me, me make dead. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Who needs flame potion? I need blade dance. Gold. The card would probably have been better to have. Let's upgrade the most useful power in my deck. The only reason it's useful is because I might draw it on turn one. <laughs> and 23 incoming. Can I handle that? Oh, almost certainly. Uh, your move. I know what I want to do. I want to be on on five on the turn I transform him. How helpful. smart oh I haven't got curses <laughs> I would be smart if I had curses but I don't was there a way to get curses oh, am I going to be in the 1700s because they didn't get curses that's kind of sad oh yeah you're not doing anything this turn are you I guess I am doing something this turn, and that is ending your life violently, predictably, fatally, all of the words. Skewery -wery -wery. And dead. Yeah, and it was the curses that made the difference. Maybe there was somewhere I could have gone. Maybe if I'd taken the, that last enemy instead of the question room, I would have... Hmm, I should have counted mystery machines. Well, let's see what I'll try again tomorrow. I didn't actually see where I was on the... <laughs> I didn't actually see where I was on the leaderboard. I didn't think I was on the leaderboard, to be completely honest, but... Twenty-nine. See you tomorrow.